write a short note on William Caxton. Marks 5 to 6. Answer. Generally accepted as the first English to work as a printer and the first to introduce a printing press into England, William Caxton circa 1422 to circa 1491 was a very influencing figure in the preservation of English literature. He was actually a multifaceted genius, a printer, merchant, diplomat, writer, and translator. He operated his printing business incessantly for fifteen years till his demise. During this period, he had printed almost all of the English literature existing at that time. While making a trip to Cologne in Germany, he observed the new printing industry and was greatly influenced by that. He wasted no time and set up a printing press in Bruges, with collaboration of Colid Mansion, a Fleming. Bringing the knowledge back to England, he set up a press at Westminster in 1776. He is credited with printing as many as 108 books, out of which four-fifths were printed in the English language. He was a great translator too, with 26 translated works in his quiver. His translations of Thomas Mallory's, Le Mort d'Arthur, and Chaucer's, The Canterbury Tales, are milestones in the development of English literature. Caxton is also credited with standardizing the English language through printing. This facilitated the expansion of English vocabulary and the regulation of inflection and syntax. However, Richard Pinson, who favored Chaucery standard, was a more accomplished stylist and consequently pushed the English language further toward standardization. On the whole, William Caxton is an ever-bright star in the firmament of English literature. Because of his immense influence on English literature, he also got selected among the 100 Great Britons in a BBC poll in 2002. He is the real pride for England. Finished. Please subscribe to the channel for more updates of ready-made notes on English literature. Also, please share this channel to help any student pursue a degree in English literature. Please do not forget to subscribe, like and comment.